You know what? I, I gotta fucking talk, son. Like, give me a break. Look at it. Look at it now, huh? Oh, you guys are like, you're like matching your car. Okay. Oh, it's cute. You know, like those, you know those dogs? Shut you know the fuck up. You wait, like, you drive a like green car. Look at you. Oh, oh shit. God. Oh, oh damn. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh, my nose. Holy shit. My nose. T bones me. I could, I could, I could gun. I could, a piece of crap. <laughs> Okay, sir. Remember when I asked you for as much detail as possible? I was headed down this way here, going that way there, going a the normal way, and then this jackass here tries t-bones me like a piece of shit. That sounds like a story a child would tell, sir. You're an adult man. Why don't we try that again with more sexy, details, man. please, sir? Sexy shit. Mm. Mm. Um. So, mm. I've I, I got a green. He's got a red. He comes. Right through the right through the intersection here is T bones me. Destroys my truck. Sends me sends me flying all the way over here. All the way over here. Right there. <clears throat> Knock my burger over to it's a mess in my truck. What kind of car was he driving, sir? Milkshake. Milkshake went everywhere. He was driving a truck. He was driving a truck. Where's right his there. truck now? I don't know where it's it's gone. It's gone. What know. do you mean it's, it's gone? gone? Where'd it go? Well, this trailer's right there. I don't know where the truck is. All right, it's gone. You don't know where the truck is? It's gone, but his trailer's over there. where the truck get to, sir? I don't know. It just it vanished. Poof. It Poof vanished. Right Poof. Gone. You been drinking it all today, Mr. Irvine? I, hell no. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a superstar. I don't drink. I'm sick as shit. Oh, fuck it. Oh, oh. Yeah. You keep up that kind of shit, sir, and they're gonna be thinking you sexy as shit all right up there at the state jail. You understand me, sir? A gentleman of your build, yes, they would make love to you all night long in the folds of your fat roll, sir. So do not test me. Shit. Exactly what did he say to you, sir? He said, I give you $3,000 cash, cash money if you say it's your fault, son. That's why, what he told me, son. Oh. I said, fuck you, bitch. I told him. Mm -hmm. And then you came, son? Yes, sir. All right, Mr. Barkov. What would you like to see as a resolution out of this, sir? You want to see him jailed? Obviously, your truck ain't here for repairs, so what are you looking for, sir? Him to pay for the damages? Put, put him in peace, son. Prison. Put him in. All right, roger that, sir. Okay, uh, I got all your information, Mr. Barkov. You are good to go, sir. If you'd like to take off, you certainly may. I appreciate your cooperation. Thank you for calling 911. Of course, it's my Uber. Yes, sir. Can I, can I walk this way to town, sir? Yeah, you can walk that way to town. Go on ahead. They're going to love you fat ass in peace and... He's not <laughs> wrong. Man. I ain't gonna bring. Go on ahead, gonna... lady. Get on out of here, girl. What? 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 Are you doing, man? I ain't gonna bring. I ain't going to no prison. Hey, you ain't in charge, huh? boy. Do you? Do you feel in charge? What? What, what the hell? Do is you wrong feel here? in charge? No, I did not feel in charge. All right, let me out of here. These damn cuz. No, sir. Yeah. Any more of that caterwaul and that attitude, you're just gonna hurt. You're gonna hurt yourself. All right. Now, if you're what you're telling me is true, Mr. Irvine, and I do not believe you, sir. When they get off work to catch a blowy, they're gonna find you up in there, knowing you're gonna need the money to sustain your girth, sir. Mm. <clears throat> yeah, that's true. Cost, All right, sir. The jail Excuse sentence, sir, since you was dishonest, is gonna be 367 months. I'm sorry, what? what, what oh. 367 months, sir. Is, am I on a reality? Is there a camera here? Am no, I, sir, there ain't no camera. I'm being punked. It's just me and you. Where the hell is Ashton Kutcher? Ashton Kutcher's done dead. He's been et by the boys up at state prison. Oh, my God. Oh my. All right, do you sir? have any questions? Uh, 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 I mean, no, I guess not. What'd you just say? 
I guess not. No. What'd you say right before that? Uh, I said, oh my God. What'd you say right before? I guess not. Uh, I don't know. You don't know? I don't know. All right, Mr. Irvine. I talk a lot. You, sir, should take this as a very cautious warning. You understand that? That's like looking into mm -hmm. your future. Mm -hmm. You're going to be spending all your time up at Bolingbroke with ain't a penny to your name. You continue doing this kind of bullshit and you lie to me again. You hear me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Now the fine I'm going to waive and the jail sentence I'm going to reduce to 15 months. You fuck with me again on any scene ever from now until the earth tilts off its axis, rotates into the sun, boy, and I will smash you like a fucking bug. in me. What? Going to be about... Uh, Sorry, sir. Way. What was that? Hello? Sexy. Not overweight. Sorry, Sexy. sir. You interrupted me. I'm going to have to start again now. County Dispatch, 309. Uh, sorry. Requested 1091 transport to Bolingbrook State Prison for what appears to be 10 pounds of monkey shit in a five-pound bag. Going to have to tell the boys to resist cutting some bacon off his back. Going to be up at the mm -hmm. Davis substation here. Going to be sloppy looking. Drives like he looks, wearing a ball cap. Sounds like a budget Johnny Cash. Going to transport up mm -hmm. to Bolingbrook, medium security. Going to be a number two male, about six feet tall, about 350 pounds. Looks like a trucker, probably high on meth. Later on, dude. All right, we got a... Oh, shit. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Uh -huh. All right, we're going to cut you loose, fella. You get the fuck on out of here now. Right. Don't be up there putting on yes, some sir. kind of sexy fashion yes, show sir. for these other inmates. They's incarcerated. Now move it out. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Move it yes, out. Sir. Move, move, move. Go, yes, go, go. Um, move, move, move. <laughs> move it out. Yeah, move, move, move. Yes, sir. Let me see that belly roll. Move, move, move. Get out of my jail. Get out of my house. Get out of the church of E.L. fucking I. Move it out, pork chop. Move, move, move. I bet you if there was some pizza outside, you could get out of this jail. Move it out now. Move, 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 move. Pump, pump, pump. Pump, pump, pump. Let me hear you wheeze, boy. Move, move, move. Pump, pump, pump. Go, go, go. Get over that obstacle. What the hell? It's Yukon in here. Pull that fucking meat wagon to the side of the road now. Hard there. Oh my god. Or I'm gonna have a heart attack if I have to run. Get uh, on out of there, you! I need medical attention. Now get on the back of this, the back of this ambulance right now. You go stand in the back. All right. All right. Okay. Doc, what the fuck kind of wheels are you running on this thing anyhow? Uh, the pink one. Yeah, no shit. Get it changed back to something regulation. What's this in... What the... What is this? What in the fuck is what this? Is you better get out of that ambulance, fat body. You get out of here right now. What? <laughs> what is this? What is this? What, is what in what? the fuck is this? What is what? How? What is this, Private Pile? What is this in my hand? Uh, it's a jelly donut. It's a jelly donut? And are you allowed to have jelly donuts, Private Pile? No, no, sir. And no, why sir. not, Private Pile? Uh, uh, because you are a disgusting fat body pile it's shitheads like you sir that there wouldn't be any theft in the world you need to lock up your fat look out stop telling jelly donuts for my fucking scout too because you like him so much you have him arrested twice he i think he's 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 wearing his lungs or did you, you figure you go ahead and get him to get pile you step the fuck back there now sir now this is my area you had a chance to be an adult before in a taxi cab. You couldn't handle it. Now daddy's here to clean up the mess <laughs> and wipe up the boo-boo knee. Now what's the a whole hell of a... Mr. Pyle, you interrupt me again, sir, and I'll stop seven shades of shit out of you. Yes, sir.
Now, that don't make a whole shitload of sense to me, pal. What does make sense, though, sir, is that you picked up this shirtless fucking ball-headed turd, and you got him in the cab with 350 and then you decided you're going to show him not wanting to pay and everything else, and then you go stick it to him as soon as you get here with the promise that he'd be headed to jail again. Mr. Powell, what the fuck did I say? <laughs> he keeps grunting. He keeps grunting. And then as soon as you get into the city, you hit him with an increased price with the promise that if he don't pay, you're going to... Drag him right back here to Mission Row, have him locked up again. Ain't that the way of it? No, sir. That is not true. I would never do that. I would it never was, do okay, that. Okay, so it's, it's, it's much more likely then than somebody who's had another gentleman jailed twice for failure to pay would pick up the same fucking guy <laughs> for three times the distance of the two trips he already ain't paid for and they cut him a discount. That sounds more likely to you in your head. Sir. <clears throat> I picked him up from prison earlier. He paid four hundred and not what I'm dollars. asking you, sir. I'm saying which sounds more likely, my version or your version, that somebody who's had a gentleman jailed for two times oh, already for not paying on a much shorter ride. He's ripping no, him up a new one. To pick up that same paying. gentleman again <laughs> and give him. I will give him. You're gonna go to jail oh, again. Three eighty. Three eighty. That's fine. I'm gonna sell. All right. You fucking assholes. If you ever waste my time again for this kind of Mickey Mouse bullshit that y'all could have settled on your own, I'll make sure both of you go. You big fucking babies. Yeah. You got Gordo and Flacco over here. Nick freaking fight. Dumb and dumber. You need to run your business in such a way that you're very strict with him. Very strict indeed. And stop leaving your crusty socks under your bed, okay? <laughs> it's clogging up your <laughs> <day. laughs> Because... You're currently yeah. cheating on your wife with this prostitute, and I know that you probably hate her.